Hello kings and queens, I'm Queen J and I'm back and this is Talks with Queen J. And um, if you haven't before, please subscribe, like and comment and press the little bell below uh, so I can let you know when I post new videos. With that being said, I wanted to come on here and talk about um, a commentator that used to be on CNN. Uh, he was really... Uh, for Trump. Uh, he was a very strong supporter of Trump. He used to be on CNN uh, going back and forth with uh, one of my favorite, um, sorry, hold on guys, with one of my favorite um, commentators, Angela Rye. Angela Rye would be anti-Trump, he would be for Trump, and they would just always go head to head. So, let me read you guys what I have from my notes so y'all will know who this man is, what he's done, and what has happened to him. So, his name is Paris Denard. He's a black man, he's a Republican, and he's for Trump. Now, Paris Denard got suspended from CNN after reports surfaced of sexual misconduct. Paris Denard is a conservative commentator and Trump apologist. Conservative. Trump apologist. A report surfaced that he was fired from his previous job in Air at Arizona State University for sexual misconduct himself. Hmm. Hmm. Um, he made sexual explicit comments and gestures and was terminated from that job in 2014. His job there was the events director for at Arizona State of the McCain Institute for International Leaders. He told one of the women that he wanted to have sex with her. He played like he was gonna unzip his pants and he kept asking her to sit on his lap. Bruh. If you've never seen him, when people ask him about Trump's um, sexual misconduct he always says oh we need to forgive or he didn't mean it or that was in the past and now we see why but anyways so two women complained of him sexually harassing them and it sparked an investigation the second woman said he would throw things at her one day she caught him looking at her breast, adjusted herself, and he made a comment saying, don't bother, I've already seen it. Um, he also touched the woman's neck with his tongue. Bruh. If that ain't... <laughs> Bruh. He also, with his... Sorry, hold on guys. He also whispered in her ear that he wanted to F her. So not only is you putting your nasty ass tongue on my neck where I don't know where your tongue been, you whisper in my ear like obscenities? Like, who raised you? Like, okay. Um, Most of this behavior took place at the workplace or work events or inside the workplace. And after being put on leave, he involuntary, he involuntarily separated himself from his post the report was never made public until now the women feared coming forward because they knew that denard would make their lives a living hell afraid he would come back to the office or another event they were scared they didn't know if they were going to lose their jobs they didn't know if people were going to think they're lying they didn't know what was going to happen to them sorry you guys my thing is going in and out of focus but um, Denard has in the past sided with Trump, saying his past intergressions shouldn't affect his presidency. No wonder he supports him. So that is one of very few uh, black commentators that were on, that was on CNN supporting. I don't know why I keep doing this. <laughs> supporting Trump. Um, another one beats the dust. Another one down the drain. Another one that we ain't really messed with in the first place. So to Paris Denard, deuces, good riddance, and I hope you never find I hope you never find another job in politics, and I hope you go to jail or prison for sexually harassing these women, and not just get fired. 
Anyways, you guys, let me know what you guys think about this video. Please like, subscribe, and comment. I love you guys. Um, I just want to let you guys know that I'm up to 48 subscribers now. I think the last time I talked to you guys, I was in my in the 30s, but we're almost at 50. And yes, it's still a low amount, but I'm excited. I love it. I love the feedback that I'm getting. Um, please comment as much as you would like. Like, I want to have a rapport with you guys. I want to know what you guys think. If you think I should do videos on other things, like, let me know, guys. Like I said, I love you guys. Continue to be great. Black power. Thank you.